Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. It is not the man, Jack in the middle. Um, yeah, so I was debating whether we should just jump straight into some gameplay or if we should go through and sell a bunch of these weapons here. Um, so, hmm, we, got, we only get seven gold for that. But the point of being in here is to show you this big gun right here. This is on the front of our ship. This is what the Kestus 6 and uh, it does 500, 5810 um, damage I guess and that would be what per 5 seconds it shoots every 5 every half a second um, but we have to get within 1.5 kilometers so that's that's very very close I have been upgrading the ship 42 minutes I think that's the second upgrade I'm doing on her right now um, so let's um let's sell some weapons or i'll start selling some of these weapons i'm gonna sell some of these weapons so it's basically between here and i'm gonna go down we got some weapons today but we still don't need this stuff what is this 3.5 202 damage we 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 can't use that 3.3 you know what we'll stop at the tantrum let's see the talent yeah so we have the talent here that we're definitely going to keep some of these here these are some of the we bigger weapons um just so we could get it out of the way because all their ships are fully equipped basically you guys go watch this intro i'm gonna start selling some of these weapons and we'll jump into some gameplay <laughs> So here we are, that's much better, um, much easier to look at. Let's jump into some gameplay, and um, you know what, let me explain it now because lately the best way for me to do it is to just um, turn up the game so, so you guys could hear that, I love when you guys could hear that, and um, so I'll just do my commenting right now. So basically, running a new strategy, basically we're going with the Brawler first, which is the Monarch and then we'll go to either the falcon or the predator after that i think we want to buy a new ship we might buy a new ship today i think we could fit it in all right so let's get into some gameplay okay here we go so i think this is frontline so frontline is pretty much deathmatch you know you just fight till the last ship okay um i'll tell you guys what my strategy is because i don't think my um he knows it, you know, Frankenstein knows it, so, um, my, 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 my strategy is to kind of just rush in, be in the middle of the group, um, as you guys are going to hear discussed by, um, a ship description later on in the video, um, just something to expect, no, no spoilers, um, right because we want to go in we need to be like 1.5 for our big gun to really even kick so we really want to um you know get in there um, i want to change it up actually and see if we could find automatic fire, fire missiles so i don't have to worry about that you know wasting time because i might be scouting um you know wasting time not hitting up so well here's the mistake i dove in because i wanted to get to get the big guns but you can't go in three against one you know so we're coming in right now with the falcon and um i guess our strategy is just to stay low right now because we cannot let these guys get within six kilometers of us so i have no idea if i can stand this game right now or if he's even getting any closer but these turned out to be some uh, so, some good matches there's still four players left you can look in the top middle of the screen one just respawned in 
but we have one on his way out. I decide to, um, where the ship focuses even when you look away, so that's the good thing. The ship will still focus down the ship or still fire the ship while you scout for a new target. And, um, you know, that guy left us, so, um, uh, you can see. But that's that, that ship right there, um, I, I think I speak to you, I, 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 you know, it won't be a spoiler, but that's a bad ship right there, I think they call that the arm, not the armada, the arbiter, <laughs> we're playing space armada, they call that ship the arbiter, a nice ship, um, it's probably worth us picking one up, I don't think we are though, um, you know, I, I, I will, if I hear from you guys, I'll pick one up. But, um, I want to win it for you guys, so we'll be quiet. I'm just going to sit back and snipe it out for the rest of this match. here guys I am not taking a single shot as yet because he is outside for the most part the standard weapons I think I hit the wall there and he's still firing for the most part the standard weapons and I'm trying to dive because he's gonna get, get us uh, for the most part the standard weapons are um, six kilometers so as long as I can stay outside of 600 or six kilometers I'm good from these guys right here. So back in this guy's 5.5. We need to focus on him tremendously right now. Oh, my bad. time to time you guys might see ads pop up, on, pop up on the screen they're from the game i'm sorry youtube all right but um i'll try to edit them as best as possible but just uh you know we're warning. um i don't think i um got my chest today you know give me a second let me get my chest guys Cross your fingers, give me some YouTube luck. Yeah, baby. 40,000 gold, we could use that. Alright, guys. Um, so, um, that worked out great for us. It kind of got scary. I think I rushed in a little bit too much with the Monarch, but you know what? It's doing very well for us. I was wondering if we don't have enough ships for our league, how we're doing, if we need to actually change out some of these ships. And we actually might need to change out some of these ships. So we're going to go ahead right now and purchase a slot. That's 15 gems. Ooh, it's 5,000, but we could afford it for the 5th slot. But I think the maximum we can get is 5 slots. Um, but we're gonna, we'll take our time with that. So we're going to go in here now, we're going to look at the ships. And um, so we're just going to go straight to the top of the line, let's look at what's going on. I think I really 
want to get this ship here um but speed guys something i was noticing i was watching my last video and this ship here um this was a ship that was completely dominating us and if you could look at the help point we have the monarch and we start out at 31 so it's a little bit stronger than we are the weapon category is the same so i am thinking of, but look at the speed that's what i want you guys to notice the speed 16.9 right for the damage so we're doing a lot more damage but we are a lot slower here oh, this is kind of ugly I'll, I'll probably purchase it let me guys know you know if you guys want me to go ahead and get that yeah just just because i uh, you know why not for the heck of it i'm thinking about this one you know you know you guys let me know all right which which you would like to see would be put into the lineup but while you guys decide on that we i am going to go ahead and jump on this freak of nature right here i'm sorry just checking it out this freak of nature right here because this has the same damage points as the um aventador was it called let's, we're gonna stay on that but we're gonna go back just for the name aventador and it um and it has the same speed and the same weapon capacity so uh, i don't know if there's any other secrets let's let's look at it the ship is designed to operate in groups and has a great destructive power speed and maneuverability than any other ship of its class all right this ship here battleship equipped with the futuristic power system granting it high speeds for the ship of its size all right so um you know so damage damage 10,000 2.3 maneuverability did we pass ours look at this one here the mirage oh but we have to pay for that but look at that oh that is a nice design right there well all right so um 2.3 okay so it's gonna have we have even more damage but i'm sure everybody module combat turn combat turn we have a module called combat turn guys oh there's a lot of stuff going on i'm sorry guys but i know you guys are gonna love love to see we'll put this on so let's go ahead and jump on it make sure it is the vulture with all that big damage we're gonna go ahead and purchase that i'm gonna go ahead and blow some gems on here put that into the empty slot all right let's check out the vulture real quick Ooh, look at that baby. all right so not ships we need to check out equipment and we want to see what it comes with now going to weapons and see now this is why we wanted to take care of a lot of those weapons so we could you know see getting to here and uh, be a lot quicker more efficient so 11 11 6.3 let's 11 11 6.3 let's compare this to our other ship all right so here we are in the monarch and it seems we are doing just about the same type of damage all right but we're gonna stay f this one here um we'll use it we're just gonna use this one as she is what we was i was doing i was checking out the color so that's the standard color and then we have red and then the yellow we're probably just gonna keep it in the standard color um and then we have the engine thruster colors so uh, it comes in a standard blue all right we're just we're gonna keep our ship this one standard i'm sorry guys it just looks better the way it is let's jump straight into a battle and see how we do
go get that beacon boy, get that beacon boy. I'm sorry guys. It's your man Frankenstein. I'm out. See you in the next one. Bye-bye. Launching missiles. Drop them. Drop them. Drop them.